Yo guys, what's going on and welcome back to another video. Today I'm back with another reverse hot lap round Monaco. As we head down to the final corner, let's talk you through my lap. Opening DRS as soon as possible as we cross the start finish straight. Heading down to turn one, you've got to weave your way through the barriers as much as possible. Be careful not to clip the rear of the car on the exit as it will spin your car immediately. Through the second corner and taking a wide entrance and a wide exit. Be careful not to clip the car once again. Through the simple section, be careful not to overrun into the barrier. As we head down towards the back, there's not really a breaking point here, you just sort of uh, kind of got to guess. Try and go a little bit slowly, just don't over, um, overdo it into the barrier. Through the no Velge you can, you've got to be very careful on the exit, be careful not to spin the rear, uh, rear wheels up. As it seems traction goes when you try and do a lap backwards around any circuit. As we head down towards Portier, breaking as soon as you exit the tunnel. And we're actually turning a little bit early there, so we have to correct ourselves, but over, overall it's been a nice section. Heading to the slowest corner on the game uphill this time and just taking it nice and slow, catching the car on the exit as the back end came out there. Now up through Mirabeau, taking a wide exit, you need as much momentum as possible to get up this hill as we head down towards the casino section. Taking a wide exit and actually, I actually ran a bit wide there, so not the best line there on the exit, however. Flat out down this hill, obviously very, very quick when you go down it, heading down towards the final corner, breaking just after the F1 2016 sign, taking a nice apex, avoiding the barrier on the exit, opening the DRS as soon as possible, and that's a reverse hot lap, Ram Monaco, 116.0.